Welcome back to Den for Flux. Today we are going to learn how to interface the KY036 metal touch sensor within Arduino. This sensor is super handy for touch sensitive projects like alarms, interactive display, or even touch sensitive lighting. So let's get started. Let's quickly go over the components you will need for this project. In Arduino board, the KY036 metal touch sensor, buzzer module, breadboard, and some jumper wires. The KY036 metal touch sensor module is an analog digital sensor that uses a transistor to detect changes in electrical conductivity. When the transistor is touched with a finger, the conductivity changes and the module emits a digital and analog signal. The digital output can be used a switch that changes the state when touched. The analog output can measure the intensity of the touch. The detection threshold can be regulated using the onboard potentiometer. This module consists of a transistor to detect a touch, an LM393 differential comparator to control the digital output, a 3296 watt potentiometer to adjust the detection threshold, six current limiting resistors, two indicator LEDs, and four male header pins. It consists of four pins, A0, G, positive, D0. Connect the VCC pin of the KY036 sensor to 5 volt pin of the Arduino. Connect the ground pin of the KY036 sensor with ground pin of Arduino. Connect the D0 pin of the sensor to digital pin 8 of the Arduino. Connect the VCC pin of the buzzer module with 5 volt pin of the Arduino Nano. Connect the ground pin of the buzzer with ground pin of the Arduino Nano. Connect the signal pin of the buzzer module with digital pin 2 of the Arduino Nano. When a touch is detected, the digital pin reads high. Turning on the buzzer module. And when I again touch the sensor, the buzzer turned off. We can also use a relay to control light in place of the buzzer. That's it. We have successfully interfaced the KY036 metal touch sensor within Arduino. This setup can be used in a variety of projects, from touch sensitive lights to alarm that activates with a touch. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more electronics and Arduino tutorials. Let me know in the comments what project you would like to see next.